New at six, some recycling programs across the state are struggling. Flagstaff, which is a city known to be environmentally conscious, stopped recycling some items. Yeah, and in surprise, recycling has been suspended. Now, Team 12's Matt Uris reports Mesa's current program appears to be unsustainable. Additionally, Mesa made money and a lot of it on its recycling program. In fiscal year 2012-2013, Mesa earned upwards of $800,000. Fast forward to now, and the city reports it will lose more than $1 million in the same program this fiscal year. The reason is twofold. First, the city has effectively lost its largest recycled goods purchaser. The Chinese have put in uh, restrictions on the contamination rates that they will accept for materials that are going into their country and um, our recycling vendors say that they're not able to meet those contamination rates. Second, Scott Boucher, the city's sustainability director, says processing fees for local vendors have been going up the past five years or so. In an effort to at least slow these trends, changes are coming, including what you can recycle. The city of Mesa is rebranding their program, and what we will be accepting is um, beverage, bottles and cans, food cans, cardboard and paper, that is clean, dry, and empty. Contaminated recyclables increase costs because such materials damage equipment and have to be transported again. And the issue is arguably widespread. According to a review by the city of Scottsdale, 28% of total tonnage was taken from the river recycling facility to the landfill. So what we're saying is when in doubt, leave it out of the blue barrel. Boucher says the city is expected to renew contracts with two recycling vendors Monday evening. This will give the city more time to search for a potential solution. Matt Uris, 12 News.